and welcome back to the Stranded Deep. When we left off, I was having trouble cutting down some palm trees and I have discovered there is a very good reason for this. You can't. <laughs> um, now, uh, what I didn't realize is I've done some research. Uh, basically, they've updated the game and it looks very, very lovely and very uh, amazing. And uh, I'm very much liking what they've managed to do with it. However, it seems that in updating the game, there are still some bits that are uh, disabled. One of which is cutting down trees, which means you can't cut down trees at the moment. So if I'm going to make anything, I've got to make it from bits and pieces that I can find. So first things first is to build a campfire um, from what I've collected so far. So I was going to build it here, but I get the feeling perhaps I should build it on the beach. Uh, so let us see where would be a good place to build. I kind of feel like here, around here maybe. Because I've got sort of mid midpoints between other islands. I can always build like a house further inland at... Uh, a later date. So, yes, let's start building here. So, campfire, okay. Campfire, so I need 20, 20 sticks? Oh, okay, no, I don't need 20 sticks. And we have our campfire, okay. So, campfire pit, so I need, oh, there we go. And then I want to make it into a spit, campfire spit. So I need a lashing for that. So, lashing I know I get from a yucca plant. And now I've got to try and find a yucca plant, but I don't know if I can cut down a yucca plant or not. So, uh, anyway, this episode, um, I'm just going to do some exploring, basically. And exploring and picking up... Uh, as many... Oh, hang on. Yucca. Can I... Yes! Okay, so basically, this episode is going to be about... Um... Okay, I don't have enough space to pick things up. Uh, I drop. Uh, let's drop... Top. That will come in useful, but for now... That's my... D that they use to drag. Yes, okay. Right, let's take the tarp back over here to where I was. Um, so, yeah, it's a bit of a shame that not all the features are working, but it's it still makes the game, it still leaves the game uh, playable, which is good enough for me, because it still means that I can do a few things. Right, okay. So, uh, I want a campfire spit. Et voila! Right, okay, so, let's drop all the items I have and see what uh, else I can do. Because I need to eat. So let's put those down. So this is where I shall make my sort of base camp, as it were. Okay, actually, let's put the sticks mm, up away from what is that? Some more driftwood to go here. More driftwood. Uh, coconuts, right. I do need to open up the coconuts. Because... How do I get my watch? Use? No, I thought it was X to get my watch on. Oh, F. Okay. Right, let's change that, because that needs to be X again, because that's what it was before. I keep forgetting that. I don't think X was anything else just yet. Inventory drag use watch X. So 
Sorry about that. Uh, we're in the middle of a Harry Potter marathon, so I was just taking the opportunity to have a quick pause for a few minutes. Um, right. Okay, so I... Right, I am in need of food, then. I should build a fish trap as well, actually, that is the other thing. Oh no, don't drop any fish. Right. any fish in the shallows here? I'm not seeing any. Can I... Is it shallow enough for me to walk over there, I wonder? It might be. I might walk. might be alright doing that. Okay, I might do that. This is a good... I feel like this is a good island to be on if I've got shallows to walk through. Oh, I do see fish. Okay, good. Right. Um, in that case, then, this is where I need to build a fish trap. Okay, good. Right, we have fish traps. Should I build more than one? No, I think I'll keep it as one fish trap, but I do need... A bed would not be a bad idea. Followed by... Um, actually, before I build a bed, I should probably build... A... Uh, something to put it on. So I do need some sort of foundation. Okay. Well, as I said, this episode is going to be about uh, collecting things. It, it's I'm slightly disappointed that the... Uh, that you're not able to chop down palm trees, seeing as that is a fairly integral part of the game, I think. But, that being said, um, it doesn't leave you without other things to do. There are other ways of getting getting the materials you need. So, uh, yeah, could be better, could be worse. The fact is, well, that they give you the opportunity to get this corrugated stuff. And I've got a whole container over there that I can't chop to pieces because it's not been implemented yet, which is a bit of a shame. But I have to say, overall, as much as this might still have a few bugs here and there, um, this game's really coming along. It's really getting updated. Um, I'm hoping there will be a, a uh, console release because they've really put a lot of a lot of work. What the hell is that? Is that a bed? How the hell did that get up there? Did I build a bed and it's glitched up there or something? What the hell is that? Alright, never mind. Uh, yeah, I hope this game gets a console release or something because um, they, I think that they're, they're going to really... Uh, they're going to do very well with this game, I have to say. Um, they've really put a lot of uh, work and effort into it. I certainly think that it's a game that's going to uh, it's going to it's going to do well in future. I get the feeling because it's you look at you look at what it used to be compared to what this is now, and they've really pulled out all the stops in terms of upgrading it. So yes, it's got a few bugs and problems here and there, but just generally, um, you know, it's, it's it's fantastic. They've really they've really put work into this, so I'm I'm very uh, I'm very pleased with the with this game and how it's all. Together. Are there any coconuts up there? Yes, there are. Let's get some more coconuts. Can I not, can I not get them? Can I get them? I want the coconuts. Give me the coconuts. Give me the goddamn coconuts. God damn it. I don't have to wait to cut those down then, maybe. Alright, what else have we got here? More driftwood? Oh, he's more driftwood. Alright, let's put these into size. Oh, 
long is my axe going to last as well? Seems like I'm using it for a while now. Okay then. So let's bring these back to my small cam. Well, at least I've got lots of um, lots of wood to be using things or making something with. Got lots of wood. <laughs> Possibly more driftwood than I need, but I am not going to complain about that. Because it's like survival 101 is having wood and things. Okay, right, corrugated iron, let's just put that there, because I don't really understand what I need that for yet. I'm sure it has a function, and I'm sure I will find out what that function will be, but I shall do that in a future episode. Uh, as always, I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, favourite, subscribe, share, it really helps me out a lot, and I will see you all with another video very soon.